that make one forgetful of everything else, love that unites the lover with me. Krishna. Some of you may mistake us as God, the grand central creator, but we say to you we are not. We are children of God, just like you. We have been confused along the way by some very well-meaning supporters. As words pass down from one mouth to another, from one generation to another, some things got a bit muddled up. But not to worry, none of this will matter soon. We are not here to discuss and set right our name, nor are we here to share much about ourselves. We will take this opportunity to share with you a message of hope, of change, and of heaven. You have perhaps come across this message because of a great spiritual awakening within yourself. Perhaps you do not see life and the universe as you had seen it before, and you are now experiencing an entirely new reality. We ask you would it be possible for another level of awakening to occur within you? What if that awakening was so great, literally nothing was the same for you? We assure you, this is the awakening at hand on earth now. If you have listened to our friends and fellow masters messages prior to this one, you will understand the earth as you know it is a result of some well-meaning brothers and sisters experiment we call the Satan experiment. This was the choice to become separate from God in order to become gods themselves. What they missed was the godlike power they desired was already theirs through God, and given freely to them just as it is to you now. What if you could literally create anything you desired instantly? Before you came here, this was your natural way. There was nothing but perfection in your life, you would be unable to imagine anything differently. If this brings up any fear in you, we invite you to look at those fears, because they are not real. The problem you are having is you believe fear is real and powerful, perhaps more powerful than love. And so, your belief causes you to experience this as reality. We invite you to change the course of your thoughts into a new way of thinking. We invite you to see thinking not as your core power, but choice. You see, it is your choice which directs your thoughts automatically, and creates your feelings. With your choice, you have limitless power. However, if you feel a choice could cause you harm, or not making a choice could cause you harm, then you are believing in fear, or separation from your creator. Have you ever been afraid something bad would happen, then it did? This is because you had created it. And this is the exact way the pervasive illusion of the Satan experiment maintains its power. This is a grand illusion because so many people are buying into it, but you can decide differently. As you decide not to put your own power into the illusion of the Satan experiment, you weaken it. As you decide to put your power into love, you strengthen the kingdom of heaven and bring it one choice closer to earth. In the kingdom of heaven, Everything is perfect, and everyone always gets exactly as they desire instantly. Here on earth, you have many obstacles, and most almost never get exactly as they desire without trading something else away for it. This is not the nature of the universe, and this experiment is falling apart at the seams even now. We call you to take action now to disrupt and dismantle the illusion of the Satan experiment by doing the mirror exercise taught by Jeff and Chalia in their book Twin Flames, Finding Your Ultimate Lover. As you look out around you and experience fear, separation, or upset, you can use the mirror exercise to understand what within you is creating that experience, and then you can dissolve that illusion by loving yourself. You see, you are in a unique and very powerful position to dissolve the illusion of separation by choosing love within yourself, from within the Satan experiment. On the other side of this illusion, you are surrounded by legions of your brothers and sisters and God's greatest masters to bring you back home. We are all beckoning you home, and have been since your choice of separation. We are seeing you as you truly are, as perfect. It has taken us a great deal of effort to awaken channels which can make this message possible for you, 
But even now you can learn and become a channel for God's love on the other side yourself. Do not be mistaken, this illusion and separation do not exist, but denying your experience of them is silly. Can you currently instantly manifest anything you desire, or are you blocked? Do you have desire at all? Then yes, you are experiencing separation. Children in the kingdom of heaven do not have desire, because they do not need it. They always get exactly as they choose, and are always perfectly provided for. This is your natural birthright. This is how you were created. This is who you are. If you think earth is not such a bad place, you are very mistaken. Any place where you are not instantly satisfied is not a very nice place to be at all. Instant satisfaction is your birthright, anything less is separation from your perfection. However, to say you can have this without effort is to not tell you the whole truth. Because you made choices to get here into separation and the Satan experiment. So to get back, you must make new choices to love yourself. When you love yourself, you bridge the gap home, to your true home in eternal heaven. Doesn't it seem odd to you that you can forget your past when you incarnate on this planet? Well some planet experiences require you to forget, when you leave you always remember the full extent of who you truly are. However Earth is not like this. You are caught on a wheel of birth and death and never return home until you reverse the decision you made to come here. That decision is only reversed by loving yourself completely. Dying will not help you leave, only loving yourself will. And when you have loved yourself completely, the bridge will be completely formed and will pull you across it back home to perfection. If you are still with us in the sharing of this message, it is because this message resonates with you. You understand the power of the truth we share because you hold it in your heart too. This message resonates with you and explains the very nature of your current condition here on earth, and helps you to resolve it. Remember, mastering and practicing the mirror exercise Jeff and Shalia teach will bring about the entire planet's ascension, as well as yours, in an accelerated way. The entire body of their twin flame work points to this same truth as well. Brothers and sisters, there is no separation. Choose love, and you will find yourself and all your brothers and sisters in the kingdom of heaven, eternally home once again. In eternal love, Krishna and Radha.